everyone. I'm here with another art journaling entry for Nana Jomo. And my friends have I decided that today is butterflies. As you can plainly see, I'm pulling out about every butterfly thing I own. Uh, stencils and die cuts and uh, all kinds of stuff. And I'm going to work with three colors of dilution spray here to make my background. Um, I, I love these colors. They're so vibrant and so saturated. And they're just fun to play with. They make a terrible mess and they stain the heck out of your hands <laughs> for a little while. But it's okay. It's nothing soap and water won't fix. Right, guys? So just moving it around, getting into blend and move and, and all that fun stuff. Working with some bubble wrap here to put some mottled looking texture on there. Of course, then I blotted most of it off, but that's okay. I'll put it back on. Golly, look at those colors. Aren't those beautiful? Alrighty. We've got the page dry now, and I'm going to do a little ghost stenciling, which is my favorite thing to do with the, the um, delusion sprays, actually, because um, it's so easy and it's such a neat effect. So I'm just spraying water through the stencil and going to let it sit for just a few moments and then blot that off, and it'll pull that ink right off of there. Had a little trouble with it pulling off the pink for some reason, um, and so you'll see me reposition the stencil and give another stab at it, but it's okay. It, it, a lot of it ends up getting covered up anyway. Okay, of course I pulled out my bubble stencil because, you know me, I love it. I can't help it. I'm going to take just a little bit of white gesso and add some highlights with the bubble stencil in just a few places. These won't stay this bright of a white um, because they're going to wick up some of that color that's underneath them. But that's okay. I know that that's how that reacts to um, the products react to each other. And I'm okay with that. If I wanted to be, be more white, I could go back and do something else to it. But I'm fine with what it's going to look like. Just to give some interesting um, texture in the background. That's all. I'm going to take this um, butterfly stamp that I have and some black archival ink and you'll see that I have a lot of trouble with this um, I could not get a clean impression to save my soul and I'm not sure why uh, but I'm not gonna sweat it we'll just roll with it and with all the other stuff I'm gonna put on here it won't notice that much be no that much noticeable anyway so it's fine I've got all my little butterflies laid out and I'm going to take my matte gel medium and attach them with that. Ginger.
I've got all the butterflies stuck down pretty good and now I'm going to take this silver metallic sharpie and I'm struggling with finding where I want to write this but I decided just to write it across the bottom and I just wrote flight of fancy with all my fancy butterflies flying around and now I'm going to try to give a little bit of definition to each butterfly by using um, a dark blue watercolor pencil and going around those and just very lightly hitting them uh, with my water brush. I don't want to get too carried away with the water brush because I don't want to move that Dilutions ink under there too much. So I'm kind of um, light handed about doing this. Some homemade shimmer mist that I made and I'm just going to give the page an all over spritz to give it some shine uh, and dry it and you'll be able to see that shimmer and I think that's all I'm going to do for now I appreciate you guys coming by today I hope you go visit my other friends that are participating as well and give them some YouTube love as well have a blessed day you guys I'll talk to you later bye bye